This what, is what exactly are you doing up here anyway? Nothing trumps the Constitution. So. Mm. Well, I mean, state law does. It's actually state, federal, private property. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel once again. Great to see you. If it's your first time here and you enjoy this type of content, don't forget to smash that like, share, and subscribe button and ring the bell for future notifications. I just found this channel today, Durango the Clown, and he owned this cop with an epic ID refusal. Please get to the link in the description and let him know in his comment section that News Now Ninja sent you. Let's get straight to it. You cannot be on my admin side taking pictures. You know, that's the First Amendment, right? Not over here. There's no restricted area signs. You cannot be taking pictures. Where's the restricted area sign? 41. Go ahead. I'd probably go ahead and call and get a deputy up here. What's your name and badge number? Corporal McDaniel. You can't be over here on this side taking pictures by the admin side. You well, they the should public. have a you restricted can stay in the area sign. Area, but you cannot come over here and take pictures. Well, they should have a restricted area sign. Sorry. I didn't say that. After Durango had contact with this officer, one of the public employees decided to sound their car alarm. So if you're using headphones or if you have your volume turned high, be prepared to adjust your volume and know that the honking only lasts for a minute. So stay tuned. What's up, man? How's it going? Not much, just recording the facility. Recording the facility? Uh, yes, say so. I got you. All right, uh, did you get permission from the sheriff and all that? I don't need permission. It's First uh, Amendment. Actually, being private property, you kind of do need permission. This is public property because uh, government funded? Uh, not exactly, dude. Yes, there's sir. Too many, there's too many private things going on up here. Well, you hiding something? No. We've got personal information up here that you can't see. That you're not allowed to see, not without up That's where the out. restricted areas are. Mm -hmm. You're inside the guard lines, though, dude. Uh, actually, this is the public park. This is public parking for the people. You see that? And that's, they would... that's called a guard line right there, dude. Yeah, and that says that all cars may be searched, but why do I I'm not a, a vehicle. Why do I have a car alarm going off? I really don't know. It started going off. I have it recorded, so. Okay, you got your ID on you? I don't. I got a uh, Fourth Amendment, man. Fourth Amendment? Yes, sir. Yeah, you do. Uh, I understand that, but there's also state law stating you have to provide for my, for my Do you have a uh, sergeant on duty, actually? Yep, absolutely. I'll get him up here. Stand by. And what's your name, badge number? Deputy Case. Uh, Deputy Case. Alright. Yeah, and she was saying something about you can't record over here, but they should have a restricted area sign if they don't want people to record over here. Is this consensual, by the way? This what, is... what exactly are you doing up here, anyway? I'm just up here gathering uh, information for a story. For a story? What kind of story? Do you, you work for a news article or are you well, with freedom the media of, or anything? Freedom of press, sir. Freedom of press? Usually you have to have some kind of badge or some kind of uh, affiliation. That's the First Amendment, sir. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm not telling you you can't talk about your First Amendment. I'm just asking if you're affiliated with anybody. No, sir. I'm freedom of press. Gathering content for a story. Here's the issue that you're running across, and this is the reason why it's kind of bothering me a little bit. You're actually taking uh, taking pictures of personal vehicles over there, though, too. Well, that's not illegal. If they don't mm. want them to see it, they shouldn't be in public. Mm. Anything you can mm. see from public, you can record. Mm. Not necessarily, because uh, as far as Georgia consent law, it actually have to have both parties There's no involved. consent. Yeah, there is. Only in restricted areas. Ah, okay. How long you how long you been studying law then? Uh, a good while, sir. A good while. So where'd you go to school at then? At, I don't answer questions. Huh? I don't answer questions. Okay. Well, I've got my lieutenant coming up here. He's gonna he's gonna pretty much say the exact same thing I'm, I told you already. Well, you guys need to possibly get updated on the Constitution. Nah, well, we're very well up to date on the Constitution. That's good. You also need to get updated up, up, up on the OCGA of uh, uh, annotated codes of Georgia as well too. Mm -hmm. Well, I know nothing trumps the Constitution. So. Mm. Well, I mean, state law, the uh, state law, you still have to abide by state law, state law, state I'm law. I'm abiding by the law just now. I mean, I'm walking around recording a public facility. This is government funded. Hmm. Okay. Well, we'll let my lieutenant, he's on his way. He's from the south end. This is consensual, right? Huh? Consensual, right? 
Do I, uh, have I put you in handcuffs? Have I, have I detained you in any way, shape, form, or fashion? No, I'm just making sure. I'm getting it for the record. Yeah, absolutely. I'm just sitting here talking to you. And I actually asked you for your ID, and you still haven't presented any kind of ID or any form of identification to who you are. Because I don't have to. Uh, yeah, actually, there's a state uh, state law stating that you have to actually provide some form Absolutely of identification. Absolutely not, sir. You have to at least provide a name and date of birth. Uh, Mr. Sergeant Miller can tell you that firsthand. Sergeant Miller? Who's Sergeant Miller? Uh, I guess he works for y'all. We don't have a Sergeant Miller. Well, he lied to me. <laughs> yeah, we don't have a Sergeant Miller. Never have. Well... I got the video of him telling me his name's Sergeant Miller. Uh, I did get pulled over for him a while back, and it was the same thing. I was out in public recording, whatever, and um, he he was trying to use the intimidation tactic, saying, "Oh, well, you got to give me your ID." Let like, me all this. Here, here, and I, uh, this is all explanatory. explanatory okay, all I'm trying to get you. When you're out in public, that's a public place. This exactly. is, like you said, and I agree with you, that this is a government-funded area. Okay? Exactly, which means that's right. But here's report. where it separates that. You've got a guard line right there. Well, it's the not state, close, This sir. is actually state, federal, private property. This okay. isn't private property if it's mm-hmm. government-funded. You're not trying to. You see, that's where everything gets twisted up. Now, are you from Habersham? I don't answer questions. I'm just asking you if you're from Habersham. I don't care where you're from. I'm just asking if you're from here. See how this is going to go. Okay. All right. We're going to hang out here. We'll sit in, si- in awkward silence. That's fine. Cool. Until my lieutenant gets here. All right. But since I did get clarity, there's no restricted area signs over here. So that means that I can walk over here and record. Let me suggest something to you. Let me let you talk to uh, my lieutenant first before you go back in there. Because we do have an impound. Well, that is that. That is uh, that is items that are under investigation. I understand, but if you when guys don't want people going back there, there should definitely be a well, restricted I mean, area sign. Clear with the guard line, but that didn't works. say restricted area, and it doesn't say private property either. And I did read the signs before I came in. Deal, sir. Lieutenant's gonna call the sheriff. To let him know. All right. Then we'll go from there. Okay. So just to be clear, there's no restricted area signs over here. So I'm more than free to go over there. Correct? I'm not gonna stop you. Well, I'm just. All right. I'll walk with you, but I ain't gonna stop you. Okay. Yeah, as soon as it says... I need to get says, some exercise anyway. I hear that. 
But, um, yeah, as soon as I see a restricted area sign, I'll, I'll stop. I mean, I'm not going to go past any restricted areas. And see, I, and honestly, dude, that's, the, that's what I'm worried about. I just don't want you stepping over something and, like, trying to open doors. Because I don't no. know you from Adam's house, Cat, man. I don't know who you are. I've never dealt with you before. I just like to know who I'm dealing with. I understand that. But understand, and understand this, there is a law that states that you have to provide some form of identification. No, sir, there's not. Yes, there is. That's my Fourth Amendment, sir, mm -hmm. and I can almost guarantee you don't want to have to deal with the lawsuit. <laughs> okay. You can sit there and argue all day long, but I'm just telling you. Well, if that were true, you would have done got my ID. See any restricted area signs at all? Got cruisers back here. These must be the the junkyard for the cruisers. How's it going, sir? Hey, Doug. Yep. What's up, buddy? Howdy, All right, dude. All right, so, for the sheriff, as long as you don't go in any kind of any gate fences, we're good. Have a good day, man. All right, you too, man. Thank you for being professional.